Microsoft SharePoint provides several powerful extensibility models for developers. These models work both with SharePoint Online and the on-premise version of SharePoint. These extensibility models are supported by multiple APIs both on the server side and the client side, which gives developers a lot of choices, but what the developers love more than APIs is simplicity. This is why Addin Express has released the Ribbon Designer for SharePoint and Office 365. The Ribbon Designer is a set of specialized components that allow you to quickly build custom SharePoint ribbons. In addition, you can also customize built-in or default ribbons. The Ribbon Designer components are integrated within Visual Studio and allow you to create new SharePoint ribbon projects or add a new ADX ribbon to an existing SharePoint project. These templates are automatically available to you inside of Visual Studio once you install the Ribbon Designer. Using the toolbox, you can quickly add tabs, groups, and controls with just a click of your mouse. As you build your ribbon, you can use the Ribbon Designer to select items and change their properties. The In Place Designer allows you to see your custom ribbon as it will appear during runtime. You can navigate through the hierarchy of your custom ribbon, and as you do so, the current item highlights in the preview pane. Here you can also change and set properties, as well as attach code to ribbon events. Combined, these four components allow you to use the Ribbon Designer to quickly build custom SharePoint ribbons. You write your business logic against the various SharePoint object models and APIs. Then the Ribbon Designer outputs the Ribbon XML required for display within SharePoint. With the complex task of producing Ribbon XML suitable for SharePoint, you can focus on writing your functional code that implements your business rules. The bottom line is the Ribbon Designer allows you to build custom SharePoint ribbons without any knowledge of the Ribbon XML specification required for display within SharePoint.